Hello dear viewer, welcome to today's presentation. In today's lesson we are going to talk about similarity and the question we are going to use here is the figure below shows a triangle with a shaded region. So we have the triangle and then it continues. If the area of the shaded region is 48 square centimeters, calculate the value of EB. So we have EB right here. So we will solve this as follows. We are told that the shaded region has its area as 48 square centimeters and we are required to get length EB. So we will be able to get length EB by first of all getting the area of this unshaded part which is triangular in shape. So in order to get the area of the unshaded part, let's call it X, we will apply similarity. So first we are going to get the linear scale factor. We are getting linear scale factor because in this triangle, as you can see, we have two similar triangles, a bigger one ACB and a smaller one DEB. So since they are similar, we are going to get the linear scale factor by comparing the ratios of corresponding lengths and we have two corresponding lengths which are already given, that is length DE and AC. We have the sizes 3 centimeters and 9 centimeters. So we can use that to get the linear scale factor which is 3 over 9. If you like you can also have 9 over 3 but just many and ensure that you maintain that ratio throughout your workings. So with the linear scale factor this simplifies to 1 over 3. So remember our aim is to get the value of x and x in this case is the area of the unshaded part, triangular shape. We cannot use linear scale factor to get area so we'll be required to get the area scale factor and the area scale factor is simply the square of the linear scale factor. So we'll have to take the linear scale factor and square. That should give us 1 over 9. Now this will now help us get the value of x. So we have area scale factor which is 1 over 9. That should be equal to the area of the smaller triangle over the area of the bigger triangle. Smaller triangle over bigger triangle because in this linear or other area scale factor that we have 1 over 9, 1 is small and 9 is bigger. So small should be on the numerator and big should be on the denominator. So the unshaded part is smaller. So x is on the numerator over the whole of this bigger triangle its area should be the area of the unshaded part which is x plus area of the shaded part which is 48. So we have 48 plus x. And from here we can therefore get the value of x, we cross multiply. So we have 9x is equal to 48 plus x. So x crosses to this left hand side, we have 9x minus x and that is 8x which is equal to 48. From here x is therefore obtained as 6. So that is dividing both sides by 8. Now remember we were to get x so that x will help us determine the value of EB. Remember now x here is 6 square centimeters that is the area of the unshaded part. Now given that we now know the area of the unshaded part, remember because the triangles are right angle triangles we can therefore say area is given as a half times the base which is EB, remember it is EB we are interested in, times the height and the height you already given us 3. And remember this should be equated to the area of the triangle which is 6. So this should give us 1.5 EB, that is a half times 3, 
that is 1.5 and then we equate it to 6 so that means EB will become so you divide both sides by 1.5 and that gives us 4 centimeters and that is how we go about this question finally we have come to the end of this problem I want to thank you for staying with me I hope to see you in the next video